Welcome to Center Global News, where we have the most relevant information in the world events in teaching, education, and trade union. So, let's go to the information. Attempting against public education constitutes an attack on democracy, warned the union representatives attending the 8th World Congress convened by the International of Education in Bangkok, Thailand. Delegates discuss about privatization attacks to gratuitous and universal education, the defense of teaching profession and union rights. In this context took place the election of the new executive council presided over by Susan Hopgood of Australia as president and David Edwards from the United States as general secretary. Professor Alfonso Cepeda Salas, leader of the National Union of Education Workers of Mexico, was elected member of this council. Center leader called to fight and eradicate discrimination based on race, gender, age or sexual orientation. No es desafortunadamente en México una situación de excepción. Se da en muchas regiones del mundo. He denounced, along with the leader of the American Federation of Teachers, Randy Weingarten, discrimination against migrants on the border between Mexico and the United States, where children are separated from their families and denied education, and therefore urged governments to promote schools without borders and make education a right and not a privilege. International Education, which represents more than 30 million teachers and supports staff from 400 unions in 177 countries on five continents, during its eight World Congress added its voice of rejection against xenophobic policies that have more than 68 million displaced people in the world, 25 million refugees, 7 million of them in school age but without any opportunity of education. Teresa López Lorian, Cente News. For joining us, thank you very much. I'm Salvador Martí. This was Cente Global News. And right here and now, you are informed.